Welcome to 2K Sports. What could be better than kicking back on a Sunday afternoon watching the NBA? Hello, everyone. I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg. We'll hear from reporter Allie LaForce in a moment. Here we are at the final game of the regular season, Grant. For the players, are there some mixed emotions in these situations? Oh, absolutely, B.A. I mean, it's nice to be at the finish line, but you always have some regrets from the season. Everyone thinks their record could have been at least one game or two better. So let's take a look at the starters for the Philadelphia 76ers. They've got Giannis Antetokounmpo. MP is out there with Josh Giddey. Then there's Kawhi Leonard. And it's Holmgren in at the five. A nice shot by MP. Hey, MP's got swag now. Going right back at him with a three ball of his own. Ball with it. And it's Giddy picking him up. Out left to the wing. Here's Watson. Pass to Shangun. Here's Miller. Leonard defending. Clock at six. Three pointer. Here's Miller. Here's Watson. 15 in his last outing. Basket's good. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Now here's MP. Launches it. Another three for Philadelphia. Well, that's a mistake to give him any kind of space from behind the arc. All MP needs is just a little daylight to knock it down. Ball against Kitty. Let's a three fly. The rebound by MP. It's tough to get open in this league, and when you do, it hurts not to capitalize. Another three for Philadelphia. Look at how hard MP works, getting out in transition and finding a shot off the fast break. Here's Miller. 17 points in his last outing. And about two minutes into the first quarter here. Pass to Shengu. Over Holmgren. Philadelphia grabs the miss. And this is the first season matchup for them against this Hornets team. Yeah, they were impressive against this club in a clash of the Titans last year, sweeping the season series. Yeah, I like what you said there. I mean, both teams are in the upper echelon of the conference, but they really dominated that matchup. We'll see if that continues to be the case tonight. Now here's Ball. 17 points in his last outing. Look, I know he wanted to answer with a three of his own, but you got to play smarter. Play your game, not theirs. MP shot is good. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. Yeah, you know, they've had the advantage at both ends. They've got all the momentum early on. For Charlotte, they've gone two for seven. A sluggish start. Timeout call, the Hornets. They're coming off that loss against Philadelphia. I really think that L has to fall on their defense, or a lack thereof. Just not enough focus at that end of the floor. Yeah, and that's really inexcusable. I mean, there's just no way that you can justify that. When you don't put the work in on defense, you're going to end up on the losing end. Now here's Ball. Big time offensive force he's been. He's averaging just over 31 a game. Charlotte again missing. Philadelphia with the ball. Some momentum. A 15-2 run underway. From deep, MP. Ooh, he's been flawless tonight. Now he's six for six. They've really built this lead on the back of their perimeter game. And I like the strategy. It's a great strategy. Bury those threes early and it'll open up the inside for them later on. Here's Miller. Averaging almost 23 points a contest. A fantastic offensive player. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. MP. And the 76ers tack on two more. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. They should continue to ride the hot hand. Right wing. Up top, Shangun. To the paint. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. And let's take a moment to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for Philadelphia. Well, they found a groove, and it's from distance. So knocking them down from the three-point land never hurts. 
I would like to highlight two guys, the excellent passing they've done early on. I mean, they've done a really good job putting the ball into the hands of guys ready to shoot it. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. Tell you what, forget about easing into the game. They came out with punt blazing. Pass to Duran, and here is Shangun. Second chance effort. Misses again, now 0 for 3. MP against Ball. MP, that one's good. MP's got 24 points. A slick move by MP. Putting the defense on its heels, then pulling the string. Ball outside. Pass to Miller. Let's it fly. Yes, sir, and it's Ball with the assist that time. Miller's got seven points in the game. Whatever the defense gives, that's what he takes. A sign of a skilled offensive player. Here's MP. Oh, it's pure again. He's now a perfect 10 for 10 in this one. <laughs> He's rolling. The best start to a game you could hope for. Talk about putting up points in a hurry. He can't miss right now. And Charlotte shooting 33% in the first quarter. Here's Miller, Leonard defending. The kick out to Ball, takes the three, and again, Charlotte with the triple. Boy, you gotta love how quick Ball shot is. Doesn't take a lot of time to get himself squared up. Boy, LaMelo Ball is such a special young talent, Clark. What stands out most to you? Well, I like his length, he's a rangy point guard, but it's how dynamic he is, B.A. He's also got deep shooting range. Here's Watson. Checking his stats, he's scoring around nine and a half points per game. To the left side wing, here's Ball. It's hauled in by the Sixers. He's looking pretty unsettled at the moment. Doesn't seem like he has a great feel for his shot. MP shot is off. Goes up from the top of the key. The shot, no good. Very surprising that he came away empty there, especially given room to operate. Beyond the arc, drains the triple. MP's got 31 points. And so far, this game has belonged to MP, getting to his spots and executing with ease. To the wing, right side. Here's Ball. Plenty of room to knock down that one. He's got five. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. What a finish. I mean, he just took over himself. What a show of power right there from the point guard. Man, sweet. And you know, guys, when your point guard is making explosive plays at the rim, I really do think it sets the tone for the rest of the team. And the Hornets with possession here. Following the score by Philadelphia. And Shingun gets it to go. Read the defense and executed. The IQ showing through for Shingun. Ball against MP. And again, it's Philadelphia. Monster quarter for him. He's put the team on his back, trying to carry them to the W. And here's Ball. Five points in the game. Pass to Miller. Here's Duran. shang in the post. He's covered by Holmgren. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Yeah, I like the way they're setting the tone. Really playing with a lot of energy here at the start. Now here's Holmgren. He had 10 points in the win against the Hornets in Charlotte. And the basket by MP. Just make sure you keep getting him touches. I mean, you love what he's doing at the offensive end. Don't go away from it. Charlotte is shooting only 39% in the early going. And they double up ball. Out of bounds. It'll be Philadelphia's ball. The Hornets making a switch here. Sexton's checked in. Williamson's checked in for the Sixers. Fox comes in for MP. Now here's Williamson. Really played well against Charlotte in his last game. Even as much as we've seen him, we still marvel at the power of Zion around the basket. It's hard for a defender to deal with this kind of strength. Shooting for Philadelphia, Zion Williamson. Going to the line, shooting two. Yeah. 
He's off on the first. Oh, you look at the size of the contracts now. Clark, you wish you could still lace him up? Hey, it's all relative, B.A. Guys that played way before me probably felt the same way about the money we were making in the mid-'80s, so it's relative. But it is quite astronomical. But it is a function of TV contract revenue and also merchandising and other income from ticket sales and the like and that number is humongous and the players deserve a significant portion of that and that's why the math as crazy as it looks um, still works you can't help but look toward their defense and <laughs> they're totally lost well everything's coming too easily I mean at some point defensively you have to take something away here's Miller seven points in the game Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Shangoon. Here's Duran. And down it goes. Jam that one home. Oh, nothing soft about that. Was not going to be denied. Just took the dunk that was right in front of him. Well, you know, if nobody's going to put a body on him, then that's going to be the result. Miller, first personal foul. Second team foul. Substitution on the court. Leonard on the wing. Outside Giddy. Fires from deep. Can't hit. One for two now. And so it's Sexton who brings up the ball for Charlotte. They trail by 18. Pass to Miller. From the top of the key. And he gets the jumper to drop. Miller's got nine points. And the court awareness getting better with time. Sexton making an effort to pass it to teammates who were wide open. Here's Leonard. That one rolls around and rims out. The Hornets shooting 41% from the field so far. Sexton looking around. Pass to Miller. Fires the three. Rebounded by Fox. Tries to spin move. Here's Holmgren. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. And the 76ers lead by 18. The big story thus far, how well they've shot the rock. Very high percentage so far. And if you want to start a game hot, that's the way to do it. Here's Miller. Nine points in the game. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. The effort, the position, the timing, all there. And add instincts to that. He can sense where the rebound's going to go. And that sixth sense, guys, might be better than just about anybody else's. And he battles for the ball, gets a second chance bucket. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Giddy's gone two of four so far tonight. Here's Miller. Outside Sexton. He shoots. It's hauled in by the Sixers. Outside Giddy. Pass to Leonard. A minute six left in the first quarter here. And stolen by Sexton. Here we go. Doesn't go that time. Good work defensively by Fox. Now here's Holmgren. Williamson inside. Still no points. And there it is for him. A monster down low. Zion is scary. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Pass to Lively. Here's Miller. Leonard defending. Jacks up a three. Four on the clock. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. Holmgren's got his sixth rebound on the night. Now Giddy. And right now he's currently putting up six and a half points per game. Holmgren with a screen on white. And it's Giddy missing. And the buzzer sounds to end the first. And we got a blowout underway here. 
The Sixers on top, just dominating this one. Don't go away. We'll be back momentarily. 45. And so far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. A comfortable margin for the 76ers here, guys. Great offensive energy in that period. They're clearly on a mission. Yeah, I agree. That was a flawless offensive performance so far. I mean, the shots have been falling. They're making good decisions. That's a nice recipe there. They've got LaMelo Ball. Also, Colin Sexton out there, and it's Rush in at the three, the small forward. That's the Hornets five. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Hornets was outstanding. He had an unbelievable amount of points, and he was locked in from deep. But when hasn't he been? He just went out there and played his game, absolutely owning the opposition in the process. Back to you guys. Yeah, he was unstoppable during certain stretches. It'd be great to see him top that performance tonight. Well, his team needs him to contribute. When he's on his A game, he just makes play after play. For sure, and draws so much defensive attention that it opens up opportunities for others. Well, the Hornets shooting around 33%, not the best offensive efficiency. Ball against MP. Outside for Sexton. Can they get it? He drops it from range. Well, you know, it's obvious that Ball knows exactly how to work the angle. He gets the ball to a wide-open shooter just about every time. And so MP will bring it up for the 76ers. Coming off a win against the Hornets. And it's just so hard to stop them when they're scoring at that level. They were efficient and didn't let up at all. Well, it's really hard to stop them when they're in a groove offensively. And they were in a comfort zone all game long in that one. Now here's Ball. He's got five. Pass to Rush. Shoots over Ananobi. The shot by Rush, no good. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Here's MP. And the 76ers tack on two more. <laughs> I just love the ball movement. Second quarter of play with around two minutes gone so far. Rush, the pass to Ball. Ball's double. Over to the left wing. The three is up. It's hauled in by the Sixers. Feels to me like this team is going to need more from him, guys. I mean, if they're to erase this deficit, he's got to step up. Their offense is looking like a well-oiled machine, getting any look they want. Boy, this is borderline ridiculous. I mean, every single attempt finding the bottom of the bucket. It's tipped. Fast break, Philadelphia. Good! That's another bucket. Oh, his elite offensive play has put him in an elite group. <laughs> Impressive. Yeah, when it comes to the number of 50-point games in a season, he's now fifth all time. The Hornets have gotten only one of four shot go in. MP against Ball. Five to shoot. Outside for Sexton. Shot to stop the run. Sinks it! What range from downtown! Sexton's got six. Really starting to find himself now, guys, after getting shut out in the first quarter. From deep, MP. Good! Another from three. Buries his tenth triple of the game. Unbelievable, B.A. Unbelievable. Charlotte has gone two of three from beyond the arc so far in the second. Sexton passes to Lively. And here's Ball. Puts up a three. It's hauled in by the Sixers. Fox has got his fourth rebound in this one. 
Here's Rush. Still without a bucket. Inside. Here's Lively. Oh, oh, what oh, you oh say? Wow. my goodness. Come on now. And that one is stuffed right through. Filthy. I mean, just the arena is stunned. He's got a deep bag of tricks to dig into. Oh, I'd love to get a replay on that one. Let's keep it handy so we can see it again. Outside Sexton. To the middle. Great D that time from Port. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. And what I like about it, it's been a physical brand of basketball. It's had a little sandpaper element to it. Gritty and rough, but that's how you win games. Here's Ball, following the score by Philadelphia. Out to the right wing. Here's Rush, right now averaging five and a half a game. The three is up. And Ananobi pulls it down. No matter what he's tried, it hasn't worked. Unfortunately, the team is suffering from that. Again! What an avalanche! 60 points. This guy can't be stopped right now. They've had no answer for him in this one. Pass to Lively. Hey, from beyond the arc. And Ananobi pulls it down. Philadelphia's got it going from deep. Three for three so far in the quarter. Here's MP. And it's good! He hits another one! That's 62 points! 62! Amazing! A remarkable performance from him so far. Ball against MP. Rush the pass to Lively. Looking to win the run. Porter pulls it in. Philadelphia with the ball. To the inside. Williamson. Oh, the dunk by Williamson. They've been very well-rounded and extremely focused. Almost no holes in their performance tonight. They've been tremendous. Now here's Sexton. He has six. There's Ball with a three. Here's Lively. And he slams it in one-handed. That'll drive your coach crazy. Failing to box out. Ugh. Those are free points you're giving away. You've got to work harder on the glass. On the wing, MP, pounded by ball. MP shot is good. He's certainly been their go-to guy when it matters most. He's trying to close this one out. Well, the Hornets shooting only 31% in the second quarter of this one. There's ball with a three. Hits the trifecta. Ball's got eight. Hey, Ball has tremendous confidence, oozing with confidence. He feels like he can cross up anybody defending. For three, another three for Philadelphia. He's dropping the three ball with incredible consistency. What a barrage here in the first half. Sexton with it. Looking at his production, close to 12 points a game. Shot clock at six. Down low. Here's Lively. Williams grabs the board. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Really a prime example of the difference in how these teams have operated offensively. Much more individual play at the other end. Look at the power of that. He has to be one of the top dunkers in the game today. Absolutely salivates when he attacks the rim. He got it again. Sensational. 71 points and no end in sight. He's in the zone. The defense looks helpless. Outside Sexton. Pass to Rush. MP against Ball. Rebound by the 76ers. Fox has got rebound number five here tonight. Total commitment there from MP on that play, not allowing that interior defense to distract him at all. Free throw good, MP. And Grant, these days, more and more teams emphasize the importance of switch defense. It's so true in the modern NBA, B.A. Every team has to be able to switch to take away a lot of the action of the offensive team. So having defenders who can guard multiple players on the court is a must. And both free throws good for MP. 
Yeah, what you like about MP is how hard he worked to put himself in a position for success. And here's White. He's scoreless. Pass to Duran. To the paint. Here's Shangun. Hits it. Now two of six from the field. That's simply an outstanding play. Working the size mismatch right at the rim. On the wing, MP. He's guarded by White. And that one drops. You know, they're looking good. Really good right now because of him. He sees this game by the throat. And he's squeezing hard. White, the pass to Shangun. Pass to Watson. White with it, covered by MP. Shangun, a screen on MP. White can't hit. Philadelphia has gone 4-4 four four from three-point land in the second quarter. MP shot is good. A strong start, and if anything, he's gotten better in the second quarter. And for the Hornets, they're shooting just 35% from the floor. Miller, the pass to Watson. The kick out to White. Williamson comes with a double team. Here's Miller. He's guarded by Porter. And stolen by Williamson. Let's check in with our reporter, Ali LaForce. Well, LaMelo Ball's shooting touch was questioned coming into the league, but it's been pretty steady. He said, quote, I think I'm a great shooter. I've had it since a young age. I feel every shot I take is going to go in, and my confidence is really high. He said, I practice these shots. It's all in the snap of the wrist and the follow through. Brian? Very interesting. A flick of the wrist. Thanks, Allie. Good stuff. And here's MP. He'll bring it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. The three ball. And good. There's another. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. B.A., it feels like he can't miss. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Here's Miller. He's guarded by Porter. Watson passes to Duran. Out to the right wing. Just five on the clock. Here's Miller. He's guarded by Porter. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Miller's got four points this quarter. Miller's gotten half of his ten shots to fall so far. And here's MP from outside. And again for three. He's been on the money from deep. Definitely. Looking to shoot as much as possible. 125 left in the half. And for the Hornets, they're shooting about 43% from the field in the second. Pass to Duran. There's the triple. Ooh, nice shot by Miller. Miller's got 16 points. Well, you certainly can't fault him as the reason they're behind. He's been on target and on top of his game. From deep, MP. Goal connects again. And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. Here's Watson. Giddy defends. There's 47 seconds left to play in the second quarter. White can't hit. Now Philadelphia with it. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Here's MP. And again! That's 91. An incredible feat. Incredible indeed. This is just a flat-out insane performance. 35 seconds left to play in the second quarter. Here's Miller. Six on the shot clock. Charlotte needs to get one up in a hurry. And the Hornets, another three. They're making a few more threes this quarter, trying to cut into that deficit. Let's go with a three. Another three for Philadelphia. And this is how he shines. He's a big part of their floor spacing. And you know what? It's all about the long distance game for him tonight. He's getting it done from out there. And through the first half, a pretty lopsided affair. Sixers ahead, delivering the blowout. And join us right back here after the break for the start of the second half.
Hey folks, thanks for joining us. It would be an understatement to say it's been a great half for the Philadelphia 7. Watch out, y'all. We're in the splash zone. Better get those fans in the front row. Some ponchos, baby. Three balls are raining down, Shaq, everywhere you look. All right, and now that we are in the later stages of the season, here's how the standings are looking in the East. Thanks for joining us. Time to head... And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it's been a runaway. Hey, you look at MP in this game. He's been everywhere. Well, if he's hit threes like he did in the first half, he's going to have a monster night. Yeah, you know what? The defense is going to adjust. They'll be ready for him now, so I'm sure they talked a lot about how to slow him down. Taking a look at the 76ers. Kawhi Leonard out there with Giannis Antetokounmpo. Then it's MP, then it's Josh Giddy, and it's Holmgren in at the center position. Miller, the pass to Ball. Pass to Watson, takes a three. Giannis Antetokounmpo grabs the board. Antetokounmpo has got his fourth rebound in this one. Well, Clark with his mix of power and length, at times Giannis can seem unstoppable. You know what? Not often is it that one guy forces teams to reconsider their whole defensive game plan, but Giannis forces you to build the wall because you don't want him getting downhill or he'll make you suffer the consequences. On a nice little roll here to start this half, connecting on their first three attempts. Charlotte's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. There's Ball with a three. Again, the miss by the Hornets. Clearly out of sync to begin this half. Oh, for their first three attempts. First team Now Philadelphia with it. It's been eight unanswered for them. From deep, MP. Another one goes. Incredible. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. The BA, it feels like he can't miss. Looking to get back on track. Watson. Oh, a nice one-handed slam right there. His playmaking is something to watch. Threading that pass right in there. Outside Giddy. Wing shot on the way. Duran with a rebound. Duran's got four rebounds now. And that's their first miss after hitting four in a row to start the half. Ball right side. Pass to Shangun. Back to Ball. Shengu, the putback is no good. And Kitty has got the ball here for the 76ers. They've only allowed two points so far in the second half. They've been unable to get guys back up court. Yeah, I couldn't agree with you more. You want to be aggressive offensively, but at the same time, you need defensive balance so you can get back in transition. Ball passes to Watson. Inside. And Shin Goon gets it to go. Shin Goon's got six. At home in the paint. Alperon Shin Goon has great footwork. Ball with a steal. And he lobs it up to the rim. And stolen by Leonard. And now the Sixers on the break. Here's Holmgren. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. Second team. That free throw good from Holmgren. Yeah, as you know, as Holmgren adds weight and strength year after year, he just becomes a bigger problem for opponents. Ball finds Shingun from deep. Rebound by the 76ers. It's clear he's totally out of sync. The team needs to rethink its strategy around what to do with him. The Hornets have gotten only two of seven shots to go in the third quarter. There's Ball with a three. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. Holmgren's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Yeah, you know, they're losing in large part because he's, he's not playing well. It's really as simple as that. That's the shot they wanted. It just didn't fall. You know what? That's a confidence shaker for him, though. I mean, that's a shot he expects to make every time. Watson passes to Duran. And stolen by Kumpo. It's Giddy on the wing. Fires for three. Drops in the three. He has seven. In today's game, you can never afford to get beat in the three-point battle. You know, the only way that's going to turn around defensively is by stopping the outside shot, not getting into a shootout. They're not going to out-shootout this team. 
That one drops for him. This is what height in the backcourt gives you. Ball can get almost anything he wants in there because of that size. And here's MP from outside. And the 76ers, another three. This is what it's been since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. Boy, it's been a three-point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. Durant, the pass to ball, lets it go from deep. Giannis with the rebound. anacupo has got six rebounds in the game. Boy, this is um, bad. Tough to watch. I mean, this is really bad. He's stone cold this quarter. Man. <laughs> Woo! His energy is unmatched. And you know you're going to get those buckets, guys, when you're quick to get out on the break. Get that ball up the court as fast as you can. Durant, the pass to ball. Here's Miller. Leonard defending. Back to ball. Anna Kumpo with the block. Beyond his wings, man, Giannis' timing is what makes him a special shot blocker. Count that bucket. Giannis Running at every ball. opportunity. They have a huge edge in transition points. No expiration date on their legs. They just seem to be fresh. And they're putting those fresh legs to good use. Durant, the pass to Shangun. The three from Ball. Ball with another miss. This has not been his best quarter. You know, guys, it seems to me as though he's over anxious. He seems to be pressing, trying too hard, moving too fast. Just needs to calm himself down and wait for good shots. Pass to Watson. To the middle. Here's Shangun. Oh, no good. Unable to end this run. Here's MP. Another one. <laughs> this game has his name written all over it. He has been phenomenal. An offensive onslaught. And for Charlotte, they're shooting 36% for the game. Not great. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rush stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. High value assist there. Finding him inside for the finish. Now Philadelphia with it. This one for three. Watson with the rebound. And for Charlotte, they're shooting a low 29% since halftime. And it goes. As the official calls the foul, count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. Zion Williamson has checked in for Kawhi Leonard. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for the 76ers. I mean, they played some beautiful basketball all game. The passing has been impressive, and it's opened up things with their ball movement. They've also found a lot of shots at the arc in this one and allowing their good shooters to tee it up. Ball against Giddy. Ball's double. Pass to Miller. To the inside. Ball outside. Four on the clock. They set the pick. Fires top of the key. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Holmgren's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. MP with it. Guarded now by Ball. Connects again from distance. Ooh, you can tell he's feeling it right now. <laughs> B.A., he's on fire. Here's Miller. On to Kumpo covering. Ball outside from the arc. It's hauled in by the Sixers. Adana Kumpo has got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. He had a couple in the first, but so far he's been unable to get uncorked here. Well, I think they're getting caught in that in-between zone, no man's land. Giving up three straight from beyond the arc right now. Watson passes to Miller. Down low. Here's Lively, covered by Williamson. The kick out to Ball. To the wing on the left. Again the miss by the Hornets. Boy, I'm absolutely shocked he didn't get that one to go. Usually he's money from deep. And here's MP from outside. That one's in. Coming off a nice dish from Williamson. Williamson's got his fourth assist in this one. Ball against MP. 
Ball passes to Watson. To halt the run. Inside. And Shangoon throw it down. Turkish thunder. Shangoon tasting the sauce up top. And here's MP. He'll bring it up for Philadelphia. Fires the three. Hits yet again. Wow. And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. Pass to Miller. Over Williamson. And it's Kitty with a rebound. On the wing, MP. 18 feet out. Another bucket. Wow. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. NBA, it feels like he can't miss. And Charlotte shooting right at 35%. Not getting what they want out there. Ball passes to Miller. From downtown. And it's Giddy with a rebound. Giddy's got his fourth rebound in this one. MP with it. Guarded now by Ball. MP shot is good. The Hornets shooting a low 29% since halftime. Pass to Shangun. Here's Watson. Giddy defends. Giddy. First personal foul. And that one misses. And the 76ers with some changes. Miles Bridges checked in for Holmgren. OG Ananobi comes in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. And Fox is subbed in for Giddy. Here's MP. What an incredible scoring display he's putting on tonight. Goes up on the wing, and again, it's Philadelphia. Creating offense with his first-rate handles, MP has the ball on a string. Pass to Miller, launches a three, and he drains it, making him seven for 15 for the day. Gets the shot he wants, the defense wasn't quite connected enough. They lost contact. From deep, MP gets rebounded by Charlotte. Here's Watson. Fires it from 18. Ooh, nice shot by Miller. Miller's got 21 points in the game. Here's Fox. Right now averaging five and a half a game. From deep, MP. Good. He hits again. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. NBA, it feels like he can't miss. Here's Miller. And an OB covering. Out of bounds. It'll be Philadelphia's ball. Firing up the 2K leaderboard. The NBA's leaders in shooting over the last month. Philadelphia, number one. Second, Charlotte. And lately, both teams have been shooting the lights out. You know each is hoping that this trend continues moving forward. White, he's checked in for Watson. MP outside. 4-3. And the 76ers another three back-to-back -back threes making their defense work on the perimeter a bit throws it up high knocked loose and so the ball out of bounds and an obi touched it last a moment here to see the numbers for mp he's been really dialed in from deep during these last five games Looking assertive and in control every time he rises up to shoot from beyond the three-point line. And it's been fun to watch. One twenty-one left in the third quarter. White on the wing. Pass to Lively. Six to shoot. Here's Miller. Since halftime, he hasn't made an impact at the offensive end. Three-pointer off the mark. And here's MP from outside. That's good. And it's Williamson with the assist. Williamson's got five assists in the game. Now here's Sexton. He's got six. There's 53 seconds left in the third quarter. There's a screen to stop the run. The rebound by Bridges. Sexton's gone, just two of six shooting. 33%. The three. Oh, another one falls. <laughs> this game has his name written all over it. He has been phenomenal. An offensive onslaught. 
Sexton with it. Fox picks him up. Sexton passes to Lively. White on the wing. Pass to Miller. Bridges on the double. Here's Lively. Count that one. Here's Fox. From deep, MP. And again for three. Man, he's really launching him from outside the arc. Man, so locked in. Feeling confident in his three-point shot tonight. Out of bounds. It'll be Philadelphia's ball. No need to rush that play. That's called giving away a possession. MP getting it done for the 76ers. He added to his astounding total of three-pointers in this quarter. He may never have another night like this. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist to the game. You can count on him to deliver a few assists like this one each and every night. It sure is. I mean, he's a maestro. Great. Checked in for Philadelphia. And Grant, with the idea of league expansion, some have worried in the past that there's not enough talent to go around. You see that? You know, quite the contrary, B.A. I mean, the league's in a terrific place for talent, and there's definitely the depth for more teams to join the fray. Well, I like the fact that this is something Ball continues to work on, that deep shot of his. He knows he's got to be a threat from deep to expand his game. They've got Miller, Alperon Shangoon out there with LaMelo Ball. And it's Watson in at the two guard. That's the Hornets five. Charlotte is shooting just 38% for this game so far. Pass to Lively. He shoots a three. Philadelphia grabs the miss. Williamson's got six rebounds in the game. Back to MP. Here's the three. Yet another bucket. And this game has his name written all over it. He has been phenomenal. An offensive onslaught. Ball passes to Miller. To the left wing. Here's Watson. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Here's MP. Yes! And a nice assist from Fox. Some gritty play from MP. Other guys might have backed off because of the contact. And a clear foul there as he shot the triple. He'll go to the line for three free throws. And they've been so much more aggressive drawing the whistle here in the second half. And, and guys, I think it's exactly the right thing to do with the lead. Keep going at defenders and find a way to get yourself to the line. Duran, he's checked in for Charlotte. Staring at this deficit, they're trying to be more aggressive and get themselves to the line. That's exactly when you need to be aggressive. You know that. I mean, another good job, though, of drawing contact and getting to the free throw line. And here's MP from outside. Pure from three-point range. Yeah, look at the confidence from MP. Once he chooses a shot, he completely commits to it. Ball passes to Shingun. To the paint. And so the ball out of bounds. Duran touched it last. Now Philadelphia with it. A big stretch here going. 10 to 2 from deep. MP. Good. Another from three. He's been on the money from deep. Definitely looking to shoot as much as possible. Here's Miller. Off target from outside. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. From deep, MP. And again for three. Ooh, you can tell he's feeling it right now. <laughs> B.A., he's on fire. Scoring in the NBA is the highest it's been in over 50 years, Clark. 
you think it's time for some rule changes to help the defense? You know, I'm not sure where you would go in that regard because every rule change, for the most part, has certainly tilted towards the offense recently. And I don't necessarily have a problem with that. The NBA has made it clear that entertainment is a core pillar and appeasing and appealing to their fans is a huge driver and that means more offense as opposed to more defense. There's Ball with a three. Philadelphia grabs the miss. Williamson's got his seventh rebound here tonight. The three. And out of bounds. Charlotte will have it. I'm not sure what happened there. You just can't give away possessions in this league. And for the Hornets, they're shooting the ball at only 35% here in the fourth quarter. Ball passes to Shingun. Here's Watson from outside the arc. Nails it from three. And this is someone that can really hurt you from long range. He did that to a degree in the first half, and he's doing it now. MP looking around. Another one falls. Amazing. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. The PA, it feels like he can't miss. Pass to Shang Goon. And there's the bucket. Staying with it that time. Offensive glass getting it done. That is what Shangun brings this team. The ability to turn misses into makes. Doing the dirty work down low. From deep, MP sends it home from three-point land. And just totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming. Attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Ball passes to Miller. To the middle. Pass to Shangun. Finds it again. Six for 12 and remaining assertive. Love when Shangun looks to score, especially from the interior. And so MP will bring it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. There's the three. And yes, another basket. And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. Ball with it. Now guarded by MP. Ball against MP. Ball passes to Durant. Oh, and a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. Winning in strong fashion. A relentless effort notches a W for the 76ers. And it was a big-time performance across the board. They looked like they were having fun out there, Grant. <laughs> yeah, B.A., it was almost like watching a cat play with a mouse. I mean, they did pretty much anything they wanted to do out there today. And with the year they've had, you expect nothing less than a victory every time they take the court. Another stellar outing for them here tonight. The chess match between these coaches just getting started. They face off three times, so we'll see how they both adjust when they meet later in the year against Charlotte. And as it was happening, as it was building, you knew this was a monster game for MP. A quality offensive outing. When you get it going like he did, I'll tell you, it's one of the best feelings in basketball. Unfortunately for them, they're still going to come up short. You wish they shown this kind of fight earlier. Yeah, you know, I agree with you. They waited too long to finally ramp themselves up. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. And, you know, this run shows what kind of attitude this team has. I mean, the win is there. Go get it. Pass the ball. It's Shangun, high post. And Shangun throw it down. Ball is wasting no time showing off his passing skills. A really gifted distributor. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. From deep, MP drills it from deep. Yeah, they blocked out the noise, blocked out the distractions, kept on grinding, and this is their reward. Boy, a fantastic performance. And I'll tell you something, I mean, you get roadkill, that's always a challenge in the NBA, no matter what, and they got it done. From deep, MP buries it from three. And their strategy is obvious manufacture looks from outside the arc. Well, you know, that's exactly their plan here in the fourth. Work to find space behind the arc and then bury some threes. Here's Watson. Yep, it's good. 
So no problem for Philadelphia as they get the win. This one wasn't even close. The hometown crowd was waiting for a miracle that never came. Yeah, and this... That's insane efficiency on that shot, Paul. You killed it tonight.